Hi guys, just a quick one. I thought I'd show you this modification to a Dyson vacuum cleaner. I've swapped out the battery uh, with this Milwaukee battery. It's quite easy to do. Um, you can get replacement Dyson batteries. This one was completely dead. It's a V6 model. The aftermarket batteries are about $60, $70. But I already had this drill battery here and I thought I'd throw it in to see if it worked. So, firstly just start by um, removing the old battery. There's a screw at the back here and that just pulls out quite easily. And then get yourself one of these 3D printed uh, battery housings. You can get those online on eBay. Um, they've already got the, the connectors inside and the cables. This one comes with a switch on the front, which is quite helpful here. Uh, then you just gotta solder it into the two prongs on the Dyson. Uh, just make sure you get your polarity correct. And once you've got that together, I've just mounted that with a with a bolt through the through the bottom of the handle and the zip tie at the back. And that seems to hold it pretty well. So your batteries just click in. And to power it on, just press the switch on and off. And it still works with the max settings and yeah, it seems to be fine. The voltage is a little bit lower than the the uh, original Dyson batteries, but it still does a great job even, especially on the max setting, doesn't have any trouble at all. And it probably lasts a bit longer uh, with this size battery. Plus it's easy to swap out as soon as it's dead. So yeah, it's not a big job, but quite easy to do um, and might save yourself a few bucks.